Hi, I'm Bob, and welcome to Between the Sheets, where we look at Microsoft Excel and related technologies. Did you ever have a paper form in your hand and wished you could somehow get that form into an Excel sheet? Well, you can. Using the Microsoft Office mobile app for iPhone and Android, you can take a picture of that form and send it to Excel on your desktop. So let's take a look, see how it works. The first thing you need to do is go to the Apple App Store or Google Play and search for Office 365. Then install it as you would install any app. Once it's installed, go and open it. The app will probably connect to your Office account automatically. If you don't have one, it'll give you the opportunity to create one. Oh, I'm sure you have one. And the home screen is going to look something like this. And then you tap the Actions icon in the lower right corner. And you'll see all kinds of cool actions for grabbing hard copy and turning it into an electronic document. So the selection you want is, you see where it says Convert Text and Images, you want to tap Image to Table. Now the first time you do, it'll probably ask permission to access the camera. And you need to grant permission to make the app work. So have your document ready because the camera will immediately get activated. When you press the shutter, the app will guess what part you want to grab and convert. And you want to drag the four sides of the rectangle to adjust it. And of course, your results will vary. You know, the cleaner and simpler the image, the better and more accurate the conversion will be. Once you have it selected to your satisfaction, tap Confirm and let the app do its thing. Once it's done, it'll show you a preview. And tap the Open button in the lower left corner. And there's a good chance it'll tell you that some items need review. You can choose open anyway, but if you want to reduce errors, it's a good idea to tap the review button. And it'll then ask you about each item it finds. And you can make corrections, or you can have it ignore issues that are actually OK. And if that's what you're after, you're done. You can use Excel right on your phone. But if you want to put the sheet in the desktop version of Excel, there are still a few more simple steps. Tap the three buttons in the upper right corner, then tap Send a Copy. And you'll see a whole bunch of options of where and how to send the sheet. And of course, this will be somewhat different from one device to another, and certainly different between iPhone and Android. I have my MacBook handy, so I'm going to airdrop the file. And the phone sees it, so this will get copied to the Downloads folder on my MacBook. Now I'm back on the desktop, and I want to open up that file that I got from the phone. So I'm going to press Control-O, or Command-O on the Mac. And in the Open screen, I'm going to go to Browse. And there's my Downloads folder, and there is that book.xlsx that I got from the phone. I'm going to double-click it to open it. And here it is. Let me zoom in a little bit so I can get a better look. Great, and now I can start formatting it. Let me call it a little wider. And this is just a regular old Excel sheet, as though I typed it in on my own. So I can go and select stuff and format it and you know do whatever I want, start putting in numbers and so on. So this is as though I created it right here. Now I can probably hear what you're thinking, and I'm guessing you're thinking gee, this is such a simple sheet, it's probably easier just to recreate it from scratch than to go through all of that process with taking the picture and installing the application and blah, blah, blah. For this particular sheet, I think that's correct. But this is just a simple example just to illustrate how it works. You can do this with a much more complicated form. You might have a whole lot of forms to do. So the efficiency of it, whether it's worth it or not, I'm going to leave it in your hands because you know your work better than I know your work. There were also a few other neat features in that app. Uh, you can see that you can use the Office app on your phone to take a paper document and turn it into a Word document or turn it into a PDF, take a picture of an image that has text and convert it into real text and so on. So there's a lot of cool options there in addition to just grabbing a table and turning it into Excel. That's pretty cool, isn't it? 
Next time you're out and about and don't want to wait until you get back to the office to use your scanner, just use your phone to convert bits of cellulose into bits of data. So until next time, I'm Bob, and this has been Between the Sheets.